Hi colleagues. Everywhere I go, our members talk about the fact we can't find staff. The problem right now is as tough as it's ever been. Difficult in the city, but nearly impossible in our country regions. It's good that state and federal governments are putting more money into training and apprenticeships. The problem is, our issue is now. We need quick, instant solutions to allow our members to continue to trade and offer a decent quality service. Nationally, we've had a win with migrants being able to increase their hours they can work for us from 20 hours a week to 40 hours a week. It's only one small stepping stone. We need three things to happen quickly. Firstly, the cap on migration must be restored to the original figure of 190,000 people a year. We've got the jobs that need to be filled. We need to make that happen. Secondly, we need more jobs in, in the skilled migration basket. We need cooks, restaurant managers, chefs, a whole range of, it, of jobs that we can't fill to be allowed to be filled by skilled migrants. And we must broaden their length of stay. It's no point in recruiting someone and by the time we got them trained, their visa runs out. That length of stay must increase. The issue is a federal issue. It needs to be restored now and be assured the AHA has as its number one agenda item in the, in the weeks and months before the next federal election to lobby politicians and get an outcome. Thank you.